focus on supporting small scale manufacturing businesses because they're not only they're not like retail dependent on who's walking past their front door. They're both selling in person and online. And so they literally have the ability to bring more money, more revenue into our community. So when we think about our smaller cities and towns that maybe lost their major industry a few decades ago, this is one way for them to really figure out how to not only have great presence on Main Street and fill vacant storefronts, but to bring in customers that aren't gonna walk in in person um, and add revenue and tax base to the community. And so thinking about where we want to benefit from my perspective, that's obviously going to be in generally in downtowns or on a small town main street or in an urban larger city area, um, thinking about a neighborhood main street or a neighborhood commercial center. In some cases, thinking about a com an older commercial corridor that we want to bring breathe new life into and really look at what its future future redevelopment can look like and who gets to use it. So all of those are different parts of thinking about the outcomes we want to achieve with um, with the, the work that we're doing. So the outcome part of the question is always, what do we want it to feel like when we walk down the street later on? What do we want it, the experience to be like? What is it like on a five o'clock on a Wednesday versus a two o'clock on a Saturday? And really working within our community to, to make sure that we can picture what this looks like and how it works and how we experience that space.